What? We got a red alert? <gasps> Something's coming through. Welcome back to cbh 4K and this is Xenogate Initiative. Before we get started today, I'd like to first say thank you for stopping by. If you could hit the like button, subscribe, all that jazz, it'd be really appreciated. Before we well, hold on. Well, what is this thing coming in? What is this game coming in? Because I know Phantom Brigade is coming out. I also know Blood Bowl is coming out. Blood Bowl 3. I, I don't... I haven't played that, but... Um, I do have an idea of what it's about. I think it's coming out this year as well. Yep, 2023. Phantom Brigade. Mars Taxes is coming out this year. Uh, also, uh, what else is coming out? Xenonauts 2... Oh my. Dude, 2022 needed this love. 2023 didn't know all, need all this love. Like, what, what are you giving all these great games in this year? I feel like everyone was working on the games last year into the, this year's. Okay, let's release our stuff. Yeah, we'll buy last year. Nah, it's good. Um, I could set it to high. You know what? Let's say it to high, baby. Welcome to your first day as Executive Officer, or EXO for short, at the Z EXO Gate Initiative. I'm Rudy Cobb, founder and CEO, dedicated to fortune to the research and development of EXO Gate technology, cap capable of sending people not just across the galaxy, but across the universe. Today, we take our first tentative steps. The world is watching us, but stay focused on your goals, and we'll succeed together. I'm whispering. So as you can tell, I really like this game. Um, this is a combination of XCOM, uh, Evil Genius. If you know what Evil Genius is, Evil Genius is basically um, a layer builder. Uh, I'm sure there's like Let's Plays of it. I'll put up a Let's Play of Evil Genius one day. So a combination of Stargate SG-1. If you haven't seen Stargate SG-1, I suggest you type it into the computer and look it up. Uh, for those of you who wanted something like this, uh, this game it has been answered a wish of mine. So, we're going to start by letting stuff come in first. We're going to let our little robots come in. Those are our little robot dudes. They're in charge of running around this place, making things sure things work. Okay, so... Let's go to the build button here. Right down here, there's like this is our build button infrastructure. These are our gators. It's basically our personnel. This is like the world map where we set up missions and all that stuff. And Earth is right here in the center. And there's no threats detected. There's alien culture here. We just know about the humans. We don't know anything about else. We don't have any artifacts collected. We don't have any word for oh. I didn't catch this last time. So we can collect artifacts from the trips. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. You need a research test? No, this is the research section. We can't undo much here, unfortunately. Um, which is sad because I think uh, I always like doing the research, messing around with the research tree. Alright. Now, uh, as for... I think we can construct the living quarters now. Yes. And living quarters. Break room right here where they can eat their lunch and other goodies. So yeah, I'm basically giving them a dig command so they'll dig up the uh, area. And then once they dig up, they're gonna put down tiles and they'll smooth it out. Uh, they're gonna just take care of it. In fact, we might skip ahead. I might uh, cut this part out because you guys don't really need to see that. Oh, look them. 
digging away. Actually, I think we'll set up the. I think we'll set up the. Um, mess the. the uh, what you call it? The living quarters here. You know, that might be a better idea. We'll set up the power room over here, actually. Yeah. So we got like a checklist we gotta do. We gotta build the barracks, blah, 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 and we gotta build. So that's how we build something. I should probably show you that. Okay, so you click on the build thing. Instead of picking mining pick for the mine, you go over here, you can pick to build walls, you can pick to build barracks, mess, and laboratory, and power. They're building the power, and so let's go with the barracks. Okay, now that our building is built, we can just click on the button here, and you can just go into the build things that we can make for it. We can make did I do that right? Alright, well, that should be enough. Okay, we got power rooms. We got abundance of power, which I'm all for. Now, uh, we can make some. Can we? Let's rotate that. Yeah. Okay, let's make this bigger. Mm -hmm. Alright, do we want to make... I say we make the laboratory over here, actually. Because I like to have the mess hall and, and the um, living quarters in a similar area so that they can... Freely come out of there you go just click on it again if you want to erase a an accidental mining situation that's why it's called that but yeah you only have three droids I don't know how to make more droids so keep bear that in mind don't overtax them with too many tasks to do so, okay, now we get a period budget summary. We got plus 5,000. We got plus 50,000. Huge. Medical treatment, okay. So, medical treatment is high. That goes into the patents. That goes into what we'll um, do later on. I'm just making an abundance of room here at the base already just just um, so I don't have to worry about it later on in the mess hall the lab this is also I don't have to worry about this later once it's up and running I can just like all right it's, Okay, let's just have one out, just so we can have like a general idea of where where we can place the beds. We can place them like here, or we can. Just, how about we place them like right here? There we 
go. Okay, mess hole. It's going to be very busy there, but that's okay. Now all the warm welcome guff is out of the way. Let's get down to business. Mr. Cobb's purse strings are notoriously loose. Thus we, the committee at the committee, are here to ensure that space exploration remains profitable. We shall monitor your progress and release funds when, you're, when you achieve your goals. Next up, find life in the universe. A difficult but profitable endeavor. Endeavor, wouldn't you agree? So we gotta hire three scientists. Okay. Oh, lab is not that big. Well, in that case, let's expand, said lab. We'll make the lab big. <laughs> I'm making this lab big. Actually, that's not, that's, that's big enough. Okay, so I'm full up with food. All right, while they're doing that, we can start a new recruitment campaign. Now, as you can see, there's different classes. There's a medic, there's a soldier, there's an engineer. We're gonna to get to the medic and the soldier this, but the diplomat scholar and engineer, they're, they're coming, I think, but we're just gonna focus on those three classes. So, but we're gonna focus on the scientists first because the scientists, it's our first thing we're gonna get um, five thousand. That should get us a nice number. Uh, campaign duration four days. A splurge a lit a bit. Okay. All right. Now we can click on the gators again, and we can go check what we can get. Okay. Now there's. Three ones you want to pay attention when it comes to scientists. These are the three body, precision, mind strength. Those are three things you don't have to worry about just yet. What you want to worry about is social, knowledge, and logic. Social means they're good on missions, making uh, team-based decisions if you put them in the leader. So I would recommend someone with high social skills as the leader. Okay. So this guy's just got high social skills, so he'll lead the expeditions. All right, now, knowledge is basically their ability to do science stuff, and logic is basically their ability to solve puzzles and various uh, scenarios. So I will put hire this guy because he's got good logic. Now we need a at home. Actually, you're good on all three, so we'll hire you. Now we need like a final one who's got good knowledge. And you're actually exceptional at everything. Um, we just need one more because they'll drop their job is to have high knowledge and stay at the base and Alright, we have five gators. Tape. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Okay, 
we can just have him hang out for today. Alright. I hope they've been taking care of that. Let's not make the... Yeah. Let's not make the robots struggle too much. It's a sample container. It's a bio sample desk. What does it do? It lets you analyze stuff you find on missions. And that holds the stuff that you catch on missions. Let's put that on there. Okay. Uh, it's going to take someone level 2 to do research. And finally, a patent desk. Now, that, this lets us uh, use the discoveries we find on missions to basically... Uh, we, we can leave a little space. We need all of it. Uh, to make money off of them. We can make patents off of the research we do. Off, sorry, the samples we find. Now, here comes the fun part, gang. We get to start doing missions. Okay. Okay, let's start with you. Because you're... Create a mission. Create a team. I wish there's a way to create a team outside of this. I don't see if there's a way to do it. But you have to create the team within... Um, you can even name it. Let's call it... The XO's. The XO's. We'll call them the XO's. Uh, let's give them a nice little X on that thing. Is there an X in here? I don't think... Uh, this looks like, like a, that's, not, that's good enough for an X. Uh, colors. You can just select team color. Create the team. Alright. Uh, now, there's a problem with that. Because there's nobody on the team. So let's put the team leader in. What are you? You're good with social. So we'll make you the team leader. Okay, you're good with logic. So we'll make you... The second to come in. You're the Spock of the team. And she looks, these two look like they're good at everything. Yeah, you look like you're decent at it. Eh. Yeah, we'll put you in here. We might put these two in teams later, but for right now, that's the main team. So I like the fact that we get little teams that we can set up ourselves. Okay, we started the mission. They're about to go off. Look at them. So proud. Now, uh, normally I wouldn't recommend you uh, learn to balance your teams, but right now, since we only have scientists we can are capable of recruiting, I suggest we just send the scientists into the end. I think we'll, we'll probably keep those three together as a science team throughout the playthrough. For no other reason than we, we just need like a science team. The we missions were just specializes in bioweapons are up today. You have to find signs of life. Oh, we have to study it by. Okay. Well, those first two are easy. Okay, we're going to need to assign someone to this. Okay, so he's in charge of that. All right. Uh, 
there's life here. Uh, Pisces is me with a pint life. Okay. Uh, friendly plant life, I hope. I'll let you guys read that because I'm tired of reading. <laughs> Try and relax. Uh, say something epic. Say something humble. Say something fun. Hey, just be yourself, man. Be yourself, bro. Take your time. Take a tree. Okay, so okay. Okay, we are in twenty four sign. Teens and staff. Okay, yeah, put staff first. Because you can get, but you can't replace the staff. Good help is so hard to find. Oh. We might want to hire a couple more scientists so we could get more uh, bang for a buck here. Wait, wait. We can just hire this lady. I really like this game. It's looking nice. Little... Oh, holy cow! You did it. I knew we'd find life out there, but not the quickly. I watched the stream. Incredible. Those legendary worst words. Exemplary. Just pow! This guy is a wordsmith, huh? <laughs> Still, you need to keep your the money flowing if you want to keep the company committee sweet. Did I mention we can sell patents? Develop theories by studying samples from missions, then use them to publish patents. Yep, guys. Like, that's just the realness of the situation. Like, oh my god, we found a planet, life on, on another planet. Yeah, but how can we make money off of it? <laughs> like, that's the realness of it. Okay, I start writing. Okay, well now we can form a second team. Do we have... Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we got another one. Cool. Okay, we can hire you. I think that's it. That's enough. No more scientists. We can connect and create mission. Create new team. Team... Okay, come on, Exo Beta. Yeah, no, but Exo Two is fine. Uh, we'll make him orange. There we go. Okay, putting people on this team. Yeah, he's in charge of doing that. All right, you have decent social. Uh huh. Okay, well, 
you can put in here they got no assignment right now and there we go now we got another team all right having two teams will make things go faster now Okay, uh, okay, so we'll send those guys out. How many beds have we got? One, two, three, four, or six people. All right, we need more bed. All right, yeah, that's the way it looks when they go through. All right, this has been a great one. I'm having so much fun, guys. I, I normally I'm much, I'm much more talkative. But when I'm having a good time, I'm, I'm just focusing on the game. I'm, and this is what, this is what good gameplay is to me. It's like, it's. Oh, there we go. Like, I think they um, asked if they, uh, at the, you know, Q&A at the end of this, they asked if you want a tutorial at the beginning. And I kind of think a small, like five to 10 minute tutorial would be nice. Just a quick idea on what you need to be doing. All right, you guys are always in trouble. Tell me already. Yeah, let's, let's experiment. They should be fine. Uh, we don't live in Shouldville, by the way. Take a cutting. Uh, do I analyze? Uh, do it carefully. Alright, you guys are on me again. <laughs> Why don't we play? Yeah. Yeah. Some beds being created. Mm 
We just found Jack and the Beanstalk. <laughs> All right. You got XP to level two because of that. Mm -hmm. I think you should have. You should have a bed now, wouldn't it? Shouldn't he? Why is everyone getting naked? Start working on a training area. What else? That only was to hire soldiers. Uh, we can. Oh yeah, we can claim areas and start claiming them. We have more than. All right. Ah, uh, yeah. Connect it. Connect it. Of course, connect it. Okay, that's enough for now. It's not. Yeah, I'll send these guys. They are at level two. Yeah, you guys are on the wrong side, so start mission. Yay, everybody's got A med bed. Well, you're probably gonna die on the next mission. Good luck. <laughs> I can't really help you right now because med bed requires research, doesn't it? Hold on, let me check the building. Um, yeah, we don't have a medical bay. Can we just research that real quick? No, we cannot. It will require, and we're all always doing the training center. I should, probably should have done the med bed first. Should have done the med bed. Oh well, live and learn. Well, not that guy. He's about to die. All right, these guys are screaming, "Help us! Help us!" These guys are screaming, "Help us! Help us!" We don't know how to do stuff. We got those guys sent off. Alright. His Majesty? Uh, use your mind strength. I lose that team, yeah. But that's all right. We can go on a new hiring. Uh, <laughs> a new hiring. <laughs> We're creating jobs, man. Okay. So the mind control spores. Almost claimed their brains, but they resisted it. Um, well, I got away from it. They didn't resist it. They're not smart enough to do that. Team 
cartoons coming back in a few hours. Do I expand the power? Do I expand the power? Wow, they all got new levels. Good job, and they're celebrating. Like, yeah, we did it. That was a hard mission. I was about to get that uh, team back. Okay. Start right. We'll start. We'll stay ahead of the power green. We don't have ninety five power, but you know, All right, we we can chill out for a few days. Probably should have focused on something else, but that's all right. That's just the way it is. That's just the way it is. I turned up the in-game sound just so you know, the second half. Well, not the second half, but um, throughout the rest of the thing, because you know. The game sound effects are pretty nice, and uh, also the music is oddly zen. I like it. I love it. I'm all about it. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah, I was having a little fun there. Scream, it's now. <laughs> all right. Okay, initiative. Our finances are proceeding adequately, but that could disappear quickly with a well-aimed lawsuit. For be it. For be it from us to tell you how to run the initiative, but our risk assessment shows we are lacking in health and safety department. You might also consider recruiting a soldier or two as well to be our to help our investors feel more secure. Put it on, put it on your radar. Okay. So that was basically them telling, like, okay, we want you to build, uh, get medicals, and also. Also, be prepared for soldiers.
I think that's about it. Alright, uh... Do you want to connect? So let me create these two missions right here. Yeah, we'll create these two missions. You go here. And you guys... Well, those two missions going. Oh, we should have done that level one mission. Whoopsie dang. Level one mission. You know what? We have. We're probably gonna get a couple of ones coming in soon. So we'll have them train up on that. Okay. So how do they just we hire three soldiers and two medics? Hire two soldiers and two medics. Let's have a training room right here. Team's already off. Nice effect. Oh, remember everyone? It's a demo. We're gonna let this uh, play out. I heard, I heard the music like fading out, but you know that's fine. We're gonna let this build this nice little. Uh, Alright, what do you guys want? Mm -hmm. Okay, we, we gained some more. Now he's a level 3 scientist. So we can turn this into the training room. Training room. Oh, uh huh. Oh, he's on level three. I think it's time we hire a medic.
I hired a soldier for putting in a soldier's room first. I feel like that was a really bad, well not a really bad decision, but an unfortunate decision to make. Oh, look at all that science. Look at all that science! Yeah, look at that science. It's almost done. Alright, we can write a new pad. Alright, oh uh, yeah. We did it. We researched it. Alright. Alright, so medical bay. I say we place it right next to the training facility. I mean, we could expand the base out a bit, but. Uh, this is going to be a short demo. We're almost done, actually. In fact, I think I, my next big thing was the training center for the soldiers, and I already jumped ahead of that. campaign. We'll get, we'll get the medic first. Um, we don't have to put that much money in. And, um, I think we'll get how many how many brooms we got? One, two, three, four, five. So I think we get like two. I guess I said we get three medics and two soldiers. Yeah. Soldier. Well, super easy to get a soldier, bro. I'm just gonna let that chill out for a minute. Got the gators. Alright, med bay. Med bay. Med bay. Alright, let's hire you. How many we want to hire? Let's see, we hire three of them. Yeah. And we have one at the base and one doing. Base stuff. You want on missions? Yeah, you look expendable. <laughs> yeah, that guy's expendable. We just. We 
hired a medic. Okay, so I say we just leave it. Um, we don't work on anything right now. We'll let them just finish up the thing because they gotta do maintenance. And there's just three of them, so maintenance is a lot of work for just three robots to do. Yeah, see, they're falling behind over here. We'll leave it alone for now. Check, but we're checking on new, on new people are here. On new people are here. All right, but let's check out the research. Is there any other research we can do? All right, there's no more research we can do because um, okay, the demo is like you know. We, you're a demo, bro. You're in demo land. You can't do this. All right, soldiers. We'll hire two of these guys. Anybody with high... Okay, you got high social skills. You can be a leader of one of these squads that we're going to be making. Anybody who's just, like, good at everything. Who we got here? All right, we can hire you. Wait, let's hire the cheapest person. Yay! We're saving money too. Watch, she has like a litany of problems. She hired a dummy. What? What do you mean you got a litany of problems? You got a litany of pro. We can put a med bed. Med bed. Um, he died. Generator destroyed. Oh my god! That guy died. He, oh my. To be fair, oh man. The generators are blowing. The generators. The generators are blowing. I should just let the guy die. Because he died anyway. Rushed to save that guy's life and he didn't he didn't live, so um, am I mad at him for dying? A little bit. Alright, we'll put that there. The Exos, they, they were the, they were the team. You know what I mean? The team. Uh, and we'll make a new team. Uh, we'll, we'll put the. Who was it? Who was that? Who had high, like high social? You did. You're the leader then. High social. Put a medic on there too. Which one of the medics? Oh yeah, we'll put the expendable medic on there. And uh, oh yeah, we lost a scientist. We lost a scientist. We'll 
we'll put yeah, we'll put you one here. Oh yeah, you're really good at that stuff. Alright, uh create mission. I will have you start mission. Oh yeah, 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 Christ for three gators. Require right, three gators. Okay. Okay, uh what are you? Alright, you got a lot of logic. We'll put you on there. Best of luck to you. All right, everyone's got a mission. Except for this poor slob, he's dead. Oh. There's a good chance of someone to get injured. I'm uneasy seeing soldiers with scientists, but I suppose the committee have a point. Not everything, nor everyone we meet out there might be friendly. Good job with the self-care, too. Can't have gators getting God knows what on their faces without a med bay. Uh, yeah, uh, that one guy, he fell down the stairs. I don't know what happened to him. Finding a child's life out there? Keep your eyes open. I have a feeling one of our teams might be about to stumble upon something huge. It's some feeling I had when I hired you. You look, yeah, look how you that turned out. Okay. We gotta get another generator built. Like, we're taxing these robots. about to find intelligent life like we're gonna end the demo like here this is like the last uh, thing we gotta do for the demo uh, the training part the training stuff was like yeah was for the soldier and the, the sign the medical stuff was for the med person okay cool describe the flowers Okay, 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 okay. Mm -hmm. Follow standard duty procedures. We got a soldier there. Soldier will take care of it. friendly. Mm -hmm. Engineer. We don't have an engineer. I don't think so. Uh, 75, 70 percent chance of success and it's because we have a scientist there. Of course the scientist fails. Yeah. 
uh, it wouldn't be a CBH 4K playthrough if someone didn't fail some uh, high roll. <laughs> Okay, okay. That was a one hell of a mess. It's so is life, isn't it? Kind of. I hope it's nothing to worry about. Not to mention our poor, traumatized team. Let's not say anything to the committee just yet. Robot squids swarming through the gate won't do anything for their quality projections. Quarterly projections. No injuries, no injuries. Hey! Even though we failed like 12 rolls. <laughs> you guys failed 12 rolls. You, you came back alive. Yeah, yeah. You failed, but you're alive. That's the most important thing. We got a red alert? <gasps> Something's coming through. Invaders are coming through the exo gate. Oh no! <laughs> Congratulations, you reached the end of the preview of exo gate. And I suggest you all wishlist this on Steam. I've already wishlisted it. Uh, keep, keep your eyes out, peel for it. And if you could, hit a like, hit subscribe. Oh, and, and thanks for stopping by. And there should be something in the uh, end card for you to watch as well. Go ahead, go nuts on my end card. I will see you in the next one.